we are going to get ready for church and we're gonna like just kind of show you what we do on Sundays. What are you gonna do? Did you know it's morning time? Are you happy? Get up on your feet, this is a shakedown. Order up that beat just like a takeout. It's somehow organized chaos. Yeah. Get busy. Get busy. Everybody get, get busy. I need y'all to report to the dance floor right this minute. Sunday morning. Welcome back to Not Enough Nelson. So today we are going to get ready for church and we're going to like just kind of show you what we do on Sundays. Sundays are a really special day for our family. It's the day that we don't work, we don't go to school, we try really hard not to like shop or go out to eat. It's more of a day that we just stay home and we be with the family or we go to loved ones houses, grandparents houses and have dinner or just anyway kind of just be together, make memories and I'm going to show you kind of what we do on Sunday and some of the things that I'm implementing that I'm really excited about to start these kind of traditions. When my kids were really little, like the older kids, they'll remember like we used to every Sunday I would do their fingernails and their toes and just kind of like have good conversations with them. And today I'm going to start a different tradition. I'm still going to do that with them too, but I have another tradition I'm going to start and I'm going to tell you guys about. But first of all, I'm going to go wake them all up. I've already had my journal time, my study time, just kind of me time. I've gotten a little bit ready and I go get them awake. As we wake them up, Benji will go down and and make breakfast and we'll go down and eat breakfast and then everyone will get ready and we'll go to there. Ledger! Hello, Ledge. <laughs> Mommy and Daddy both are waking you up today. Hello. What are you doing? <laughs> Did you know it's morning time? Are you happy? Good morning. It's like I'm oh, done. Ready to get out? I'm out of here. Whoa! Hello. You guys are awake in here. I know it. I heard I heard sounds. Is Beckham awake? Beckham, it's time to get ready for church. All right, now for the little girls. In June. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Penny. You're a good girl wearing your nose mask. It's time to wake up, love. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Good morning, Paisley. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Wait, why do you have talkies over there? Were you eating talkies last night? <laughs> Now back up is helping me wake up. Presley, yeah. wake up. How come you didn't sleep under your covers? Oh, um, I haven't been doing that because... You just like sleeping with your minky? I like sleeping with my minky and I like sleeping this way. Oh, you seem like you're awake. Did you hear me waking up your sisters? Yeah. yeah. Like, <gasps> I wake, I wake, I wake. Elsie, wake up, wake up. Let me see your hands. Oh, there you are. Lily, oh, Lily's already awake. Morning, Lily. Sadie. Are you awake? Okay, it's time to come downstairs for breakfast. Navy! Wow, I've got all these helpers helping me. Good morning. We are getting ready for church. Showing everyone how you're ready for church. So, get your ass and come down for breakfast. Ledger, are you helping daddy? Um, yeah, he's been handing me eggs. What happened right here? Well, I was waiting for you. Right there. He threw the whole egg in there. He cooked that himself. Oh, you just threw it in? And I just wanted to cook well, it. Well, it's so hard to put an egg in there from that distance, huh? But you can't touch it. Yeah. It's so hot for babies, huh? kind of threw it.
so after breakfast, we all go up and get ready. And you know what? My older kids help a ton with my younger kids. So it's not as hard as you would think. It's somehow organized chaos. that I want to start. When Kennedy and Cassie were little, I used to do like all their like nails and toes and even the boys, like that's when I would cut their toenails and we would just like, <laughs> that's when I would just do some like, you know, upkeep and cut their hair or whatever, but just mostly talk to them, right? And so we're going to start that tradition again in the nail salon doing that. But also I have a fun tradition that I want to start in my closet, okay? One of my favorite things to do in my closet is to like plan, right? And to like, journal and all that kind of stuff and so i thought what we could do is one-on-one -on -one, just invite you one at a time you can sit on the window bench and we can kind of talk about the schedule that you have coming up for this week but then also maybe talk about some of your goals and some of the things like you want to accomplish and how i can help you accomplish those things and just what we can do to help you feel more successful in your life okay so how does that sound that sounds that really fun i think so i think it'll be fun it'll give us opportunity to talk and plan and just have one-on-one -on -one time and then dad is going to start doing something once a month with you guys so each one of you separately will go into dad's office and he's going to talk with them about budgeting budgeting so dad will actually help you logistically to pay all of your bills so he will go through your account help you pay your bills online and just kind of talk about budgeting and your savings goals that's probably good because Cassidy and all of them call dad every time in the car and they're like dad i don't want to do this i know it's good to learn budgeting skills and dad actually graduated in accounting so he's actually really really good at that so he can help you guys budget and get on the right track for like what you want to have saved by the time you graduate from high school and stuff oh, like that ten thousand dollars you know and just, yeah that's a great all right, we'll spend it in the video. <laughs> all right so we're gonna eat lunch and then i'm gonna call you guys in one at a time and you guys can come in my closet and we'll just have some time to schedule so get your planners or your phone so you can write down your schedules for the week
for the road all my life Thirsty for adventure all my youth Chasing all my freedom well, down nice. Liberty Avenue And every time I hear a phrase My mother used to say to me Everything happens for a reason I get the feeling I need Hello guys! A little taste of home, home, home Just a little taste of home I need a little taste of home, home, home I need a little taste of home ah! Also a fun day to play with makeup Nothing like kitchen conversation Steam coming up off the stove Photographs down the staircase Showing our stories unfold And every time I hear a song My father used to sing to me Sweet words of an Lullaby, I get the feeling I need a little taste of Ready for bed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Love you all. Happy Sunday.